Families flock to the forks in the spring, but they're not the only ones coming to visit. What do you like about geese? Um, they're so cute. It's terrifying. <laughs> it's terrifying, yeah. Really? You had close encounters? Yeah, yeah. Just, uh, just don't mess with them and just let them do their own thing and then you're good. Canada geese can ruffle some feathers. One pair at the forks got a bit close for comfort, building a nest in a planter. Crews cleared out that nest yesterday and their eggs. Dean Denisick was sorry to see them go. Uh, we're in a park. If they're on the grass, uh, great. On the sidewalks, well, step around it. Destroying the nests of migratory birds when they have eggs is illegal unless you have a permit. In a written statement, the Forks North Portage Partnership says any work we do on site with respect to geese is always under permit. It says we work with licensed companies to ensure we balance the protection of the public with the safety of the goose population. There's a goose starting to build a nest just off the pathway. Yep. At Fort White Alive, Barrett Miller says humans and geese can peacefully coexist if you know how to talk to them. Yeah, you're fine. You're fine. Miller has a technique for calming down worked up geese, protecting their nests. So I've made eye contact, my finger is pointing at her beak. It reminds them actually of mother goose. Yeah, you're good bud, I'm just picking up the garbage. He says geese usually aren't thrilled to be that. near us either, but have no choice. Most of the good real estate is occupied and their numbers aren't going down, they're still going up, so they have to go somewhere. So you end up with parking lot geese, planter geese, rooftop geese. Miller encourages homeowners to let lawns grow up, giving predators a safer way to hunt for eggs and says sometimes our feathered friends just aren't great neighbors. In any species, there are some that are just way more aggressive and way less understanding of others. There are those geese out there for whom it's not gonna work. Luckily for the geese at Fort White Alive, there's plenty of room for everyone, even noisy neighbors. Emily Brass, CBC News, Winnipeg.